we are back for the next episode of the Sith Inquisitor playthrough here in Star Wars of the Republic, everybody. Welcome, I'm Ren Fail. We have been told to take a taxi to the Lower Wilds for our third trial. We are supposed to enter the tomb of Maka Ragnos to retrieve an ancient holocron that no Sith has been able to retrieve for a thousand years. That is a long time, a thousand years. Oh, but you know what we need to do before we do anything is I have an XP pot that I need to use somewhere in here. Oh, there it is. Never forget those complimentary XP pots when you're playing the free-to-play account. Because they do speed up your XP by 25%. It's about the same as having rest XP if you were to play with the VIP. Ooh, we have another quest here. Stand and account for yourself, Acolyte. Let's see what you're made of. I look at you and I wonder. Are you among the truly loyal, or do you hide treason in your heart? Who are you? I am Inquisitor Arzanen, head of Academy Security, and do not think you can so easily deflect my question. Intelligence reports indicate this valley shelters traitors, acolytes who seek to destroy our Emperor's carefully built order and replace it with their own weak-minded heresies. They hide among the faithful and obedient, but make no mistake. They will destroy us all, given the chance. We've watched as the traitors scuttle about this valley and plot against us. We know their faces and their names. It is the Emperor's will that the Sands of Korriban be slaked with the blood of these traitors. Prove your allegiance by executing them. Hmm. Are you sure we shouldn't just arrest them? They could be shown the error of their ways. Treason is a crime with only one punishment. Death. If you lack the resolve to uphold the law, that will say much about you. I'll give you the means to identify the traitors. Eliminate enough of them to prove your loyalty. Then return to Inquisitor Arzanen. I'll be watching your progress with great interest. Go now. See that the Emperor's will be done. Interesting. Is that down inside or? Uh, okay, it looks like up here. Scan and identify acolytes. You have been judged and found wanting. You are not in the traitor database. You are not in the traitor database. and found wanting. I watched you deal with those traitors. Well done. That was an impressive display of loyalty. Take this reward as a token of the Emperor's favor, and wear this badge 
It marks you as a defender of our empire. Stay vigilant. Our enemies lurk where you least expect them. I got some booties. Alright, now we can take the taxi. Displaying all authorized destinations. We travel to the lower wilds. Make sure I've got exploration missions turned on in the map so we never miss any of the planet missions because alongside of this I'm also recording a complete walkthrough of Korriban. So at the end of this we'll be combining all of these episodes together into a single. How do I get down here? Oh, I could just jump. I was trying to see if there was an elevator though. Yep, there is. I doubt I have enough to get the uh, fast travel. Side quest. A fresh young acolyte come to view my experiments. Good. I trust the sight of a messy operating table doesn't disturb you? What's happening here? Understanding the Force's mysteries requires that we seek answers everywhere, even inside a beast itself. Hmm. This used to be a Tukata, the hound like creatures infesting Korriban's tombs. On the surface, nothing special. But I alone can see this creature is an expression of pure dark side energy. Aggression made manifest. You're awfully enamored of yourself. I have gazed into the depths of the abyss and found revelations there others only dream of. The Force is alive. It expresses its will in the physical world. This Tukata was one such form. Are we another of these forms? Sith are the highest manifestation of the Force's will. I've dissected hundreds of Tukata, forging a direct connection to the dark side. Each beast I examine advances me toward perfect unity. I now stand at a new frontier, but find myself thwarted. My most perfect specimen, a Tukata mutant, escaped to the tombs before I could analyze it. Life is rough, but at least it's interesting. You don't understand. I've lost a vital key to unlocking the dark side's true essence. You acolytes delve those tombs on your trials. You could hunt that Tukata for me and retrieve its perfect brain. What's it worth? My apprentice, Malora, saw which tomb the mutant beast fled into. Find out what she knows, assist me, and you will be rewarded. Why not send your apprentice to recover this beast? She's more suited to the laboratory than the tombs. She lacks your fire, I'm afraid. Ask Malora where to seek the Tukata and return to me when you have its brain. Seeking Lord Renning's lost pet, are you? <laughs> Don't waste your time. That fool's research is pointless. I'm just here for the exercise. Glad to know I'm not the only one who sees through my master's inane babbling. Renning deludes the Dark Council into believing he's advancing Sith knowledge. The truth is, he wastes the Empire's time and resources dissecting mindless animals. But if his experiments were discredited, he would be banished and I would be rewarded. How exactly is telling me supposed to help? Look, just a minor alteration to the mutant Tukata's brain would allow me to reveal my master as a fraud. Bring me the brain before delivering it to Lord Renning, and I'll make it worth your while. I'm sure there's some way we could work this out. Perfect. Then we have an agreement. The mutant Tukata escaped to the tomb of Mark of Ragnos, it's much larger than the others, so it's easy to spot. Return to me with the brain before you see Lord Renning, and I'll take care of the rest. I don't know that we'll necessarily do that, because he, he may be on to something, because he's literally... Um, she, she says we have to modify it to discredit him, which means that technically his research is legitimate and would need to be tampered with in order to make it not legitimate. 
Ooh, what's this? We got another side quest. Oh, there's a skeleton right there, and... Sergeant Garrus. Turns out the rumors were true. Some of the sentries we lost down here aren't dead. They lost their minds, just like the Acolytes. Doesn't mean we're gonna have any easier a time getting the research supplies back, though. The crates are secured with multi-locks. If we're going to open these things without frying the contents, we'll need to get all the sentries' code cylinders back. I don't think negotiation is an option. The men aren't keen to take down their old comrades, but we'll do what we can. Once we have the code cylinders, we'll crack open the supply crates and get back. Take one out. Alright, so that's something we can do out here along the way. Oh, and there's a bonus to kill 15 of these dudes. So. Storm Cold for some of the target area. Ooh, that's a nice AoE. Okay. It sounds like it's only for stationary targets, though, so I'll have to pay attention to that. Because it's calling down an area effect into a specific area, so if they move out of the area. Looks like he just used that ability. If I had, if I had to guess. Oh, that's a that is a pretty large area. Oh my! That was pretty wicked. Not gonna lie. goodness. Alright, that ability is so awesome. Oh, no lie, man. How is it that I never played a Sith Sorcerer before? Because this is just way too cool. Oh my goodness. Place the bait to summon the Tukata.
no match for the power of the dark side. With this brain, the ritual is complete. And I shall have the power to consume the universe. Well, maybe later. Like, I still don't know. Am I going to play a good guy? A bad guy? I really need to make that decision at some point. What I could do is I could start this guy out as a, you know, evil Sith, but then he could see the error of his ways as he gets deeper into things. I don't know. Although somebody may have killed them on the way out, so I might not be able to complete this bonus mission. Time to click it. The Holocron's monument bears the mark of many hundreds of unsuccessful attempts to pry it open. Let's meditate on the dark side. The power of the dark side is in me. The monument shudders at beasts rushing in attack, so that probably wasn't the right. Monument remains unopened. Shoot lightning at it. Just open, damn it! Oh, ho, ho. the monument shudders and opens, revealing the holocron. Look at that smirky smile. I am for the wind. Now we must retreat. Sorry, no retreat. Retreat is a bad word. We must return. We must exit the cave and return to our master. He's technically not my master. He's just the guy who's giving me my bosses. I have to work on my dialogue. My impromptu uh, dialogue skills are failing. We do have a couple of quests to turn on the way back, though, so we're not going to go straight back. Oh, I'm just going to run. I don't want to battle you. <laughs> Look at those statues. I never noticed those before. Those giant statues up there. This place is appropriately large for a starting planet. Right, looks like up here we got a supply crate to open.
I am probably going to need to sell at some point. I'm not going to turn into the apprentice. Lord Renning may be a little cuckoo, but he may be onto something. I'm running out of patience. Have you finally acquired the mutant Tukata brain, or should I send someone else? Patience, my lord. You'll have it soon. I'm very curious now to Don't see his... Me again until you have because that, that was brain. a dark side option to give it to him. And hers, are they light side options? I'm genuinely curious. Have you recovered the mutant Tukata brain? Oh, it is a light side. All right. Screw it. It's right here. Have it. Excellent. This chemical will make it appear as though Renning is falsifying his research. There. All that remains is for me to whisper the right words in the wrong ears. I'm transferring credits to your account now. Give Renning the brain and collect his reward too. You've made out quite well. Can I aid your clever machinations in some other way? You've been more than useful. Perhaps another time. We shouldn't be seen speaking again. Lord Renning might suspect us. Give him the brain. <laughs> You have the brain at last. Excellent work. I trust it wasn't too much trouble. The creature was hardly a match for my power. Of course. After all, you're an expression of the Dark Side's will, too. I must continue my research at once. Great discoveries await. Take a reward and go. Don't forget who helped you achieve this victory. Yes, yes, you may stop talking now. Goodbye. Alright, got some goodies and a level. Alright. I have far too much to do to chat now. And now we must return to the Sith Academy. We have lost supplies to turn in as well as we head back. Tis what tis. Taxi cab. A little knowledge is the name of this quest. And with the knowledge we shall advance our position within the Sith. Eventually overcoming all of the other pretenders to prove that we are the one and only worthy of becoming the next apprentice. I find it easier to do voices for this character than the others. Perhaps it is because my natural dark side tendencies are flowing forth. <laughs> Not really, because I'm doing light side yes, choices. Yes, can I help you with something? Hold on. Are those the research supplies we were after? I'd given up on them days ago. You've no idea how much I appreciate this. Some of these chemicals take months to manufacture. Not much use to you, but vital to us. Thank you. You're welcome to use some of our equipment as compensation. I'll make sure to mention you to the commander. By the way, I love their armor. I wish I could find a set of that armor for my... For my dude, not this dude, where my other, my uh, Republic Trooper would love a set of that gear. Ooh, that guy has a quest, but I can't take it yet. Woo! You better not be wasting my time, slave. You better have the holocron. Hmm. A fake. Or stolen from the library, probably. I'll deal with you later. 
Now, I believe it's time for another demonstration. Gur, step forward. Yes, Overseer. Fon, kill him. With pleasure, Overseer. <sighs> Let Gur be an example to you. Fon destroyed him easily, like he will destroy all of you. Are there any other objections? You are only giving us power, Harkon. And your comments are only hastening your death, slave. Now the rest of you know the next trial. Go. You, slave, stay I hope here. we get the opportunity to take now, him out. slave, you think yourself pretty clever getting that holocron, don't you? I really am the best. You are lucky Lord Zash finds you useful. Now for your trial. The last, darkest secrets of Tulak Horde are buried in his tomb. Lord Zash wants this text. But the final resting place of the dead Lord is not easily trespassed. You will not be the first to die there. I will return, and with the text. Do not come back here until you've gotten the text from Tulak Horde's tomb. Out of my sight, slave! Well, we've just dinged level 9, and we know where we are heading for the next episode, everybody. So, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon so you never miss an update. Support if you can with Super Chat, Super Thanks, Memberships, the Patreon page. All are great ways to keep me on the air full-time. Don't forget the Discord. May the Force be with you, and I will see everybody in the next episode as we continue our playthrough of the Sith Inquisitor storyline through Star Wars The Old Republic.